Hey there, sign of Pisces. This is Kim. I'm going to do your reading for the next 48 hours. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for liking, subscribing. If you want a private reading, I do those for donations. Check out the description box below. We are going to do a general Celtic cross spread for you today. Calling in your spirit guides, angels, higher self, higher power. Give us messages that's for Pisces greater good. Pisces, what's the issue? What's the issue for Pisces? Closure. Closing a situation out. Being okay and satisfied with the ending. Card of Scorpio. Challenge. Challenge is giving over some sudden disruption. The falling of some kind of foundation. This is truly, it feels like it's marking the end of a chapter. So I feel like the morning stage from this tower moment is what the ending's waiting on to wrap up, to be out of limbo. Is the heart of the matter. Celebration with friends. Past issues. The high priestess. Trying to find answers with uh, outside of yourself, actually, because it's in reverse. And not getting satisfaction. So it's because you need to go in and maybe have some inaction for the moment. Relax. Take time for yourself. Give something a rest like recharge batteries. Maybe you were going, going, going. Present position. Okay, it's the present position may be about procrastinating or deciding that you really have to come to a decision that you're totally split about, but it's time to make the decision like a crossroads. No more procrastination feeling. Near future. Two of Pentacles can indicate change. There's two for maybe partnership. The two, two, two angel numbers about balance could be about fluctuation in wealth, but balancing nonetheless, being able to balance this life's ebb and flow externally have regaining your power regaining your power investing in something seven of pentacles is for um the ex yeah the external energy so having patience knowing that your seeds are planted and and just waiting it can be a contemplative time while you're deciding you're contemplating and comparing hopes and fears well, look, you want to get your Ten of Cups. You want everybody to just be emotionally happy, satisfied. You want to celebrate friends and family. Projected outcome. <clears throat> well, I think it goes this way, actually. It's, <clears throat> it's like that. So, <clears throat> either way... Maybe thinking about things from the past. Maybe trying to move forward with no regrets. And when this ending does happen and you get closure, then you can celebrate some kind of milestone met. Pisces, let's use Tiny Tarot. And let's see what else we can get clarified here for you. All right, so extra information for Pisces. Ooh, wow. Look, with this closure and after this challenge of the tower moments here, you're going to find your hopes and dreams come true. The star card. Wishes coming true. Hope. There's a lot of hope here. Aquarius. Hopeful situation after all. So needing to find closure, okay? Needing to find closure and, and, and or 
and just kind of like not being happy until you get closure and you meet your milestone. Scorpio again. King of Wand energy, Leo. Could be about building something. Or could be about building something in the past that just wasn't um, eh, kosher. It wasn't it, it didn't stand up. Present tense could have you. It's like this giving in to temptation or talking about resisting a ten, uh, temptation, negative attachments, the devil, card of Capricorn. Maybe that's an idea you're split about. I've never seen that card in this spread. Wheel of, I mean, in this deck, ugh. Wheel of Fortune. Something's finally turning for you. Karma's turning for you. Wheel of Fortune. Family issues. Solving family issues. Could be a soulmate issue, but working on this, solving these problems. Knight of Wands. I feel like this is movement fast. It could indicate travel. Or it could indicate a younger uh, Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. But this is... Good, this is progress. Getting out of your head, getting out of feelings of anxiety because something's growing good. And Page of Swords in Reverse is just about needing a little bit more information. Could be talking about a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius child. All right, let's get some wisdom from the Oracle for you. The creation card really wanted to come out. Oh goodness, this is a lot. Time to go. There's a lesson that's been learned. Time to go from a situation. Make sure honesty is number one on your plate when you see the truth to be told. Go the distance. Keep being persistent because you're gonna make your you're gonna meet your end goal. Come to the edge is like a new full journey. So this is gonna be like a brand new beginning. And whatever this is, whatever you tame this time, it's going to be real. Built on solid, good things. Abundance. All right, Pisces, thank you for joining me. Sending you love and light. Bye-bye.